that the board can only be written in Martin uh, in, in less than 60 days we address this uh, uh, problem. What more we can do together? These are what we call baby steps. But the good news is one problem at a time. And it's being confronted with actions, consistency, and persistency. So the same manner with our uh, COVID-19. No? In COVID-19, tuloy-tuloy tayo dyan. No? No? Kaya kayo, kanya-kanya kayo yung departamento. Uh, continue uh, excel from your field of undertaking. No? May bunga eh. May bunga. No, nga kanina, nilaunch natin. Uh, simultaneous blitzkrieg. No, without violating uh, uh, the IATF rule and all other things. So, it can be done. It can be addressed. Oh. And uh, we will continue to utilize whatever resources we have. No? Efficiently. No? Magaling si Tresurera sa kasi Grace. No? Kala yung makakahanap ng 116 million. Wala na nga tayong kapera-pera. So, matter of pano talaga. Uh, focus. So I implore and encourage each and every one of you to really focus on uh, attending to social problems. And in fact, uh, in a matter of few minutes, about 30 or so, uh, I'll, I'll be speaking again with the Development Bank of the Philippines. Uh, Dennis, Andres, Balmoris, oh, yung ating uh, tuloy-tuloy, di ba? Natira na natin yung Tondominium 1, Tondominium 2. Binondo Minimum 1. O, titira tayo ulit. Ah, hindi pa pala. Meron pa tayo isa. Basset Community. Diba? So, may vertical, may horizontal. Pero, parehong in-city. Diba? And uh, today, uh, uh, we, we are finished already with the uh, draft ordinance by administration measure. The Bible of Housing in city housing uh, in the city i would like to uh, thank uh, although hindi niya trabaho yun pero one way or another trabaho niya rin yun na uh, siya ang pinagpuyat ko doon uh, si attorney chris uh, fernandez uh, ayun si chris uh, uh, sa buong buhay ko ngayon ako nakagawa ng ganyang kakapal na ordinansa Oh, it's, it's really a, a long term and in fact uh, even the next leaders of the city will be having a hard time to amend it or uh, uh, go to uh, other directions uh, we put some measures on it so that there will be continuity of governance that we in the city government will address ISF informal settlers and Ang good news ko sa inyo, o sabihan nyo na yung mga kaanak ninyo, ha? nag-evolve yung housing program natin. Ha? Wherein, would you believe that even an 8-hour guy, anong pangalan mo, nakasandal sa pader? Marlon. Si Marlon, na nagtatrabaho sa Diamond Hotel, as utility, maintenance, technician. technician, can have an opportunity to own a condominium in the city of Manila with that new law. Because we will allocate 35% of our capacity in every project for the renters, huh? middle class, to have what you call their own. No? Naidesign nyo yun doon. So, meron tayong para sa mahirap, meron tayong middle class or working class. Plus, of course, sa employees. Katulad na sinasabi ko sa inyo, <laughs> hindi tayo pwedeng maggagaling-galingan sa kapitbahay. Kailangan sa loob din ng ating bahay Meron din tayong tinutugunan. So this is a, a massive approach. Long-term 
continuous massive approach of once and for all that the government will literally address housing and you know for a fact I am may tatamos ng ilong ni Andres yan saka ni Dennis Lacuna ni Balmoris no? na yung unit natin hindi bahay kalapate alam nyo ba ibig sabihin ng bahay kalapate iba ang bahay ng kalapate patong patong tapos isang ganun lang siya lang kasya tama mali oh, ito 44, 42 square meter 2 bedroom whether townhouse or condominium in the city so, decent honest to goodness approach long term approach of the city with regard to housing so anybody from the city citizens of Manila will have an opportunity to be accommodated government workers mga mahirap at yung working class na habang buhay na silang nangungupahan at maganda yung batas pag nabasa ninyo alam nyo bakit? o habang nagyayad ba siya ng dalawang bulig no? 2000 pag yumaman na siya lahat ang hinulog niya isosoli ko sa kanya bilang gobyerno so kung nagulog siya 10 years 2000 that's 24 times 10, that's 240,000 so soli ko pa yung principal so meron pa siyang pang-ariya para mag-evolve the same, almost the same concept, literally uh, I can only say 95% uh, parehong-pareho halos ang concept ng Singapore uh, yung kalang HDB okay, alam, mas maganda lang yung condominium natin <laughs> okay, kasi sa SM, ilang square meter? 23 25. Tama? Tama, no? O, huwag na SM. Yung mga pinatatay yung condominium ngayon. Tama? Magkano? 3 million. 2.5. Tama? O, tayo. 44 square meter, 2 bedroom. Ah, sosyal. <laughs> Kaya thanks to Dennis Lacuna. Thanks to Architect Balmoris. Sila-sila yan. So, this is a painstaking long process, but one thing for sure, we have already paved the way. And we did not stop there just by paving the way. We are building already. It's there already. It's being built. So, one way or another, it's a matter of time. Talo init! Sa lahat ng viewers ni Dean Arman Nocom, subscribe kayo rito sa Vlogcaster Dean Arman. At mag-iingat po kayo mga kababayan, always keep safe and practice physical distancing. May awa ang Diyos, makararaos din po tayo sa pandemyang ito.